What's up everyone? My name is Blair Conklin and this is my quiver. This board has a very special place in my heart. This is the book skim. It's the first board that I got to design with Catch Surf. So it's a, a shape that I came up with and it's kind of inspired from a skimboarding shape. And I've always wanted a board that you can ride and not get hurt from. So this thing's very friendly to the shins, to the ankles, to the toes. Turning on a boogie board, you throw a lot more spray than you would on a normal board. So it looks, it looks pretty aggressive when you, uh, when you smack a lip with this thing. It's quite fun for, for riding shore break where the waves are just kind of lapping on the shore. It's also a really versatile board. You can kind of take it out on any given day and, and stand up on it, lay down on it, skim on it. It's good for everything. My personal favorite. This is the 54 Special. It is four foot six inches, or 54 inches. And it is a thruster. Pretty much use this thing in all types of conditions. Kind of feels like a high performance shortboard to me. It's just like, the, it's the perfect amount of board for someone my size. Maybe you could be a little smaller too. It's great for tube riding. It's really good for airs. When I really started loving this board was uh, during the Stab High event. This was pretty much the only board I rode at Waco for like the first five times I went there. It is pretty awesome for airs. It has a little extra like flex to it. So when you hit, a, when you hit the lip at, at Waco, it kind of pops you up a little higher than, than maybe you would on a normal board. There's something special to the pop on this board. It's really awesome for going backside. The thruster setup locks you in when you're grabbing rail backside. Super good for pig dogging. I tend to do a lot of pig dogging on this thing. Yeah, I think I've probably been more barreled on this board than I have on any other board I've ever ridden. Next is the new new. This is the Twig, which I just started riding, and uh, it's one of my new favorite boards that they make. It's a twin fin. It feels a lot looser and a lot more maneuverable than some of the thrusters that I ride. This definitely has a different, uh, quite a different feel to it when you're doing turns. Almost feels a little bit more like a skimboard to me getting the feel for sliding a little bit more than you would on a thruster is really fun because you can start doing some like spinning 360s and aggressive on rail turn. You can really put it on rail easily and I think the rail is actually a little bit, uh, it's more of a derail. So it kind of it kind of locks in a little bit more like a skimboard. Four foot, 10 inches. 
I really like riding a smaller board, so I've really been enjoying this thing. It's an awesome board to, uh, to just get used to and, and try to figure out new things. The Twinny Twig, it's pretty cool looking. This is a big board for me. This is a lot of board. Usually I recommend this to my friends who are learning how to surfboard. Um, Johnny and Kalani are, are master rippers on the 7.0 log. Good for big waves, good for small waves, good for whatever you really want to do. There's a lot of, lot of volume on these puppies. There's a good amount of rocker. You don't have to worry about purling too much. And they're very stable because of how big they are. So I would say this board is probably best for getting into waves that are a little on the smaller side and you can pretty much out paddle anyone on these puppies. So if you're trying to go to Malibu and make some friends, this is the board for you. <laughs> The Whomper. Whomper is just a beautiful thing. A lot of people look at it and kind of just laugh, but this thing's serious. If there's some heavy shore break barrels at Aliso or even some little reef slabs, something where you just want to get a nice vision of the barrel, this is your board. You kind of lift your body out of the water a little bit more and, and maybe make a barrel a little bit easier than you would if you were just dragging. If you're not getting barreled with this thing, you're doing something wrong. Thank you all for checking out my quiver. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope to see you shredding one of these boards at the beach. That's it. That's it. <laughs>